This is just a short video, a uh, follow up on the video frequently asked question number five. Is drilling a breathe hole a disaster in the making? I'm just doing this video just to show the number of holes in this particular cylinder that uh, go over the point I made that if it's drilled correctly and it's the right size there shouldn't be any problem. Here we have a Webley Raider 10 and it has a number of holes already in the pressure vessel. We have one here for the power adjustment, there's three round the outside for retaining the outlet valve assembly. There's another hole here for the stocks fastening screw and then just here we have a pressure gauge on a brass mounting and the mounting is about 10 millimeters so there's a 10 millimeter hole here in the reservoir itself this is far bigger than the one to three millimeter hole we recommend for your air regulator fitting uh, the pressure gauge assembly is very similarly held onto a piece of aluminium or brass block with a hole in it and then this screws together uh, and just like with the regulator it's a block with two o-rings on either side and that's standard practice so the addition of a one and a half to three millimeter hole with the two o-rings for the breathe hole is perfectly okay